ready for more than a little breeze. Nothing to sneeze at, if you please. Are you ready for class one precision? Laser light for better decisions, like a super-focused genius on an energy-saving mission? Are you ready to get connected while you're still well-protected and get elected to be president of the Internet of Things? How does that ring? Are you ready for upgrades made so easy just with USB? See? Are you ready to get ready? Ready for this? Ready for that? Ready for everything? Ready for anything? Environment ready, precision ready, connectivity ready, upgrade ready. New Master Packed MTZ is ready. Right. That would be future ready. Another Schneider Electric innovation at every level. Well, thank you, everyone. Um, I'm not sure if everyone knew IoT could be so exciting. Um, I think that was a fantastic intro. And I'm going to try and walk you through everything that was compressed in that video today. Um, but first, I want to give some context to uh, what I'm going to talk about. And we're going to have a little showmanship today, because not only is today Innovation Day, today we're actually officially launching a new Schneider innovation to the Canadian marketplace. So bear with me, I'll give you some context, and then we'll do a little bit of uh, drama to unleash the, uh, the new product for you. We've heard a lot today in all the speeches about how disruption is everywhere and how digitization is really accelerating the changes. Changes are happening everywhere, every day. The other thing we heard a lot about is data. I don't know if you guys saw how big some of those data points were up on the screen. And this is extremely relevant when we think about our power distribution systems. Nisa talked about how power was going in both directions now. Um, we heard about how many things were being connected. And this is extremely relevant for power distribution because all of these connected things require energy. And the electricity is expected to grow. The ex demand for the Internet of Things is expected to grow by 2030 to come up to 20% of our total electricity consumption is going to be powering IT. So our infrastructure of power distribution needs to change, and it needs to change in a nonlinear way. How are we going to do this? It's really a piece of cake. We've heard ecostructure a number of times, and I want to give you a mental image that you can take with you. It's very simple. It, it's three layers. On the base layer, we have connected products. We've talked about it. These are the things that we're connecting. And what are we connecting them to? This is our edge control. Edge control is what we're using the data and we're taking decisions and we're reacting, we're actuating machines and we're taking um, formulas and we're reacting upon it. And then after that, we have our apps and analytics layer. And here, really, this is the extra frosting. This is what is giving you the insights to really take proactive actions and take different data sets and bring value into what your, your business is all about. So understanding that context in terms of the need for our power distributions to change, I'm going to talk to you about a fundamental breakthrough in this connected products realm, which is our new master pack MTZ. So we have with us today uh, Daniel Nevis, who's our global business development manager for the MTZ. And he will be over here after to give you full demonstrations. But could I ask you, please, Daniel, to unveil the Masterpec MTZ as if Brazil has just won the World Cup? <laughs> so that was a tremendous amount of fanfare. And those of you who are not familiar with breakers, you may be looking at that and says, well, that doesn't really look different than a regular breaker. And those of you who are familiar with breakers are saying that doesn't look any different than a regular breaker. The core innovation in this breaker is actually on the inside, so you can't see it. And let me walk you through some of those innovations. When we talk about power distribution, our customers, their number one issue is reliability of that power. This breaker has embedded in it class one certified meter. You no longer have to add an additional energy meter to get data from the circuit breaker. And in fact, the measurement capability is so good, you can actually detect power quality disturbances. 
In industrial facilities, power quality disturbances account for up to 40% of electrical failures. So through this technology, we can drastically improve the ability to increase uptime in facilities. The other very important innovation with these patented sensing coils is the fact that they fit in the same footprint. We have installed over the last 30 years over three million breakers like this. But what good is that technology if we can only apply it on new builds? So we've designed this breaker to fit in the same footprint of the existing breakers so we can tremendously reduce the cost for you and your customers to upgrade to this new technology. And besides Schneider Electric technology, through our services team, we can provide EcoFit solutions that allow you to retrofit other brands of manufacturers, uh, their breakers as well. Now, that is the product technology. And there's, I could go on for hours, and I'm sure Daniel could go on for days in terms of all the other small upgrades that we've done to the physical side of this breaker. But the other thing we've done is we fully digitized it. Many of you here might be engaged in projects. Up to 30% of project costs can be the result of rework. This breaker is fully digital, from design to concept to assembly to installation to commissioning to operation. At any point in that cycle, we can modify, change settings, upgrade modules. When we talk about being future ready, we can continue to upgrade this digitally. You don't have to do a mechanical trade out. So this is one of the key digital transformations in the breaker. The second is real-time performance monitoring. This breaker is now connected through EcoStructure to our systems and can provide real-time notifications if there's faults or alarms based on your criteria. And finally, I think everyone in here is familiar with a cell phone. This now becomes your digital screwdriver. You no longer need to wire up a laptop. Do I have the right software? You've got it downloaded in an app, and it connects to the breaker. So this is your new HMI, and this is your new remote control for this breaker. Directly there, even with the power out, you can grab setting data and last trip information. So why is all this important? As I mentioned, energy criticality is super important. When we run things on the Internet of Things, we expect the Internet to be up, and we need power to do that. So what I'd like to do is walk you through an example of what happens using this new technology. So imagine you're at a facility, and the power goes out. The traditional way of addressing this problem if you're lucky, it's during the day, and someone calls you and says, hey, our power's gone out, what do we do? I don't know, I'll send a, a technician down to check it out. That technician doesn't know what site it's at, doesn't know what lineup it's in, and doesn't have any idea before arriving what the problem could be. If we move into the future, you get an alert. So the facility manager, the technician, whoever's responsible for entering that facility knows immediately on their cell phone or their computer that there's a problem. Not only do they know what problem, they know which facility it's at. And I think we have an issue here at the steam whistle. We can dig in, understand which breaker it was and what other issues we had before. Using the app, we have a power restoration assistant. So it will lead you through understanding what was the cause. You can share data just as easily as you could share a post on Facebook to the experts, whether it's at Schneider Electric or within your own uh, own organization to get help in terms of what is the issue and how to resolve it. Once the issue is resolved, you can then now use your cell phone at a safe distance from the equipment and re-energize the breaker. And life is on. <laughs> 